Welcome everyone to Tuesday Night Smackdown. And we are here in New Orleans, Louisiana. Alright, well, well we have Becky Lynch coming to the ring. Also, something new about promos. I'm gonna try to do the voices for different people, so, I don't know, I'm, I might be, like, really terrible at it, but I don't know. I'll be honest, I'm a bit excited. As you all can probably guess, I'm going to be doing something tonight that I've wanted to do for a while, to say some things I've been wanting to say for a while. Are you guys excited? All right, let's do this. That was terrible. <laughs> There's a fellow superstar I really admire that I want to have a few words with. You guys have seen her lately. You know what she's been up to. She's so good at what she does, yet something hasn't been right lately. And I'm tired of not saying anything about it. You want to see this superstar? I know I do. Alright, NC Universe. Say it with me now. Naomi, come on out here. We're overdue for a talk, so let's have one in this very ring in front of all the NZ Universe. Well, we've seen the uh, exchange from these people, from these two last week. This is such a great crowd here tonight. Shame they have to watch and listen to you. You're a sorry excuse for a superstar. You're a single-handedly holding this vi division back. You're the reason I'm out here tonight so these people can see what a real superstar looks like. Girlfriend, you better step off before you get stepped on. Who do you think you are coming out here like this? Speak your mind quick before I get even madder. Everyone here in the WWE knows that you are one of the best, but the women standing here talking to you right now is just as good. Maybe better, and there's only one way to prove it. Blah, blah, blah. Is that the best you've got? Seri you seriously need to work on your people skills, because it seems like you're trying to intimidate me, and it's just making you look sad. You need to shut your mouth before you dig yourself any deeper. You're crossing a line that there's no coming back from, so I highly suggest you give considerable thought to your next move. What are you thinking? You're stirred up the hornet's nest now, girl. And when you least expect it, that's when you're gonna get stung. Wow, we've been out here for what seems like an eternity, and I still don't know what you're all about. Is there anything going on inside that head of yours? I think Naomi is just making Becky Lynch even more angry. 
I don't need any permission to kick your butt. We can have a match, or we can have a fight. Either way, I'm going to get my hands on you. And I'm going to make you sorry you ever thought you could mess with me. No one in their right mind believes that you stand a chance against me. I became the number one contender be by beating every woman in my path. And nothing's going to change when I finally get you in that ring. Well, now we all know what lies in store for us. I can't believe what we well, bold saw. statement here and by Becky Lynch. Lynch. We're in for one epic night. All right, here we go with our first match as the Authors of Pain making their way to the ring. They they will be going up against American Alpha. Akam and Razor coming to the ring. On the way to the ring, accompanied by Paul Ellering at a combined weight of 620 pounds, Razor and Akam, the offers of pain. Byron, you can bet we'll see plenty of destruction from Razor tonight. Last I week we saw Akam and Razor in action against. I'd like to thank everybody for spending a portion of their Halloween the new year. day. Next year, guys, I'm thinking the three of us should come in a theme. The offers of pain able to pick up a win. I will never dress up either. Alpha making their way to the ring. You're gonna need it. And Corey, I can tell you these superstars are excited to be able to compete tonight on Halloween. Would you stop, Cole? Do you really think these superstars care about a silly holiday like Halloween? The only thing they care about is winning a match. Like Razor starting things off with Chad Gable. This is it. Tag team action underway here, guys. When I think of tag teams that can make a major impact on today's WWE, I absolutely think of these two teams. Nice. He's inflicting some nice. serious pain here. Moved there by Razor. Now a vicious fist to the face. Razor got him there. Reversal by Chad Gable. His drop kick connects. Razor got him there. 
And now, Akim tagged in. Oh, God. That was hitting the nail right on the head. If he takes many more of those, he's going to get lit up like a Christmas tree. Yeah, and he a comes up short. To Jason Jordan. I could have told you that was going to happen. One of the most effective drop kicks you'll ever see. We may have discovered drop his kick after move. drop kick. Aiken with a reversal. That drops him in a hurry. Set flying into the turnbuckle with a brutal Irish whip. Knocked the breath out with a crushing kick to the gut. And so far, all sorts of pain dominating this match. Hits him with a headbutt. And then for the pen now. There's the kick out. Jason Jordan able out. to kick out right away. Razor tagged in. Clapping the ears and then tossing Jason Jordan. Needs to make it to the corner here, Corey. Jason uh, Jordan with the tag. The outlook is not very good for these guys right now. I can tell you that. Check out Chad Gable's offense. Razor got him there. Here it comes. He's got him. You better stay right where he is. Tag made to Aikum. His strikes have a little extra on them tonight. The drop kick hits the target. Now Chad Gable. Oh boy, he is rolling. Going for a suplex. He is a one-man gang in there. Reverses that one. Ain't no stopping him now. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. Can he do it here? And a kick out. A kick out at one. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. Oh, yeah, here's Akum. And Byron, he's still down after that one. Yeah, that did some big time damage, Michael. Akum waiting for Chan Gable to get to his feet. He misses on that one. Were his eyes even open? A Russian oh, leg sweep. Russian leg sweep by Akum. I can't believe it. Now, Michael. going for his finisher here. Aikum's going to finish things off once and for all. Power oh, bomb. Pure devastation. Game, set, match. This one is Jason over. Jordan able to break it up. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. Wow, I can't believe he had the energy kick to kick out, out of that. One. Yeah, but he's hurt, guys. Whoa, missed by a large margin there. Come on, how do you miss by that much? Tag made to Razor. Jawbreaker reversal. Lightning fast reflexes. No, he reverses it. The end may be near. And now, make him with a power bomb. Power bomb from the Albanian psycho. Here's his moment, Michael. Yeah, rope break. Just look at this man. He's all business. 
Will this be it? Never say die attitude out of him. Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. Arm tag. There's that one. There's now Chad Gable. Chad Gable connecting there with a good shot. Throwing him in the corner. In the best but a reversal. Escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Diving into his bag about his shoulders are down. And he kicks out. Kick out, out two. Not enough damage done. Jason Jordan in with the tag. Now Jason Jordan tagged in. Atomic drop followed by a super kick. And the elbow drop hits. And down he goes, thanks to a vicious gut wrench suplex. Oh, he turns it around. Yeah, and now right where he wants him. Akim going for the power bomb. You'd have to think hitting the finish here would end this thing. Still trying to get back to his feet here. He's clearly in a bad way right now. And Jason Jordan reverses it. I'm sorry, that's Razor. That's I think I might have said Akim. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. I don't know. A reversal. Connects with a counter. Doesn't show any signs of getting now, up here, guys. Akim no, he's taking in. one heck of a beating, Michael. to reverse it. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. Oh, yeah, here's Akum a second time. A Russian leg sweep. Oh, Russian leg sweep by Akum. Here's a chance and to now win this. Akum going in for the pen. Over the well again. A kick out at two and a half. Nice a kick, kick out at two. Yeah, you can turn it on in the blink of an eye. Uh oh, he's in trouble here. Now Aiken setting up for the power bomb. Uh oh, Aiken's gonna finish things off once and for all. Boom! Power bomb. Just when you pinning him in the middle of the kill. ring. Can he do it? And he breaks up the pin. Chad Gable breaking it up. Gonna be tough for him to fight back. But Aiken so going for a second one. He's not looking good here, Byron. No, he's got to get up, and he's got to get up now. He's on the defensive here. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. It looks to me like his partner's itching to get in there. And now might be a good time to give him what he wants. But remember, guys, his opponent has a long way to go if he's looking to even things up. Oh, with a bone-crunching spear. Can he finish him off here? Did you hear and Now the I sound think Jason Jordan going for impact? his wow. finisher. The angle slam. Like that can't be enough, can it? One, two. I think that kick, kick out at two. Everyone, very nice. He's not getting up. You can't like his chances right now. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. Jason Jordan is taking control. He is a one-man gang in there. Now, deadlift suplex. Jason Jordan is on the attack. That slam put him in a bad way, guys. Desperately needs to make a tag here. I don't know. It's going to be tough to make it to the corner. He's making a statement here with this attack. Now into the 
over the top rope and knocking Jason Jordan to the outside. And in the meantime, tagging in Razor. The longer this fight goes on, the more wear and tear on each competitor. Who is going to have enough to pick up the win? Oh man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Aiken he doesn't want to knock do this outside off, the ring. Razor knocking off Chad Gable. Wow. And spear wow. by Jason really Jordan. And the strap's coming down. Jason Jordan getting serious here. Over. You know what? It's just not his night, fellas. I mean, he's already executed his great right move by Jason Jordan. But can he follow up here? And rope that break. Is a huge opportunity for Jason Jordan. It's Paul Ellering getting on the ring apron. Distracting the referee. Look at this. And Paul Ellering has just been ejected from this match. And Gable Apparently. is feeding off the WWE Universe. Drops the elbow on him. The better part of Balor. And he gets out of there in a hurry. Looks like he needs to regroup. Get his thoughts together. A clubbing clothesline. Now Will he be victorious? Razor and for the pen. Oh, and two counts. Still trying to get back to his feet here. He's clearly in a bad way right now. Ain't no stopping him now. Byron, he may be down for good. That wouldn't surprise me at all. Not after the beating he's taken. And for he a pen. Barely a three count. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. Razor continuing the beat down. Chad's playing it up big time now. Somehow has to, and he comes up short. I could have told you that was going to happen. Taking off his feet here, and it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. He is a one-man gang in there. He's going for the pen. This could be it. Just making his presence felt there. Taking him a while to get up here. I don't think he has anything left, Michael. If he suffers much more, he may lose all mobility in that shoulder. He's looking for the win. And the officers of pain getting the win just like that. To be honest, that match wasn't that great. But the offers of pain getting yet another win. As next up is cruiserweight action as the, the Brian Kendrick going up against Xavier Woods. Costumes. 
now we await the entrance of Savior Woods. Xavier Woods making his way to the ring. And Corey, I can tell you these superstars are excited to be able to compete tonight on Halloween. Would you stop, Cole? Do you really think these superstars care about a silly holiday like Halloween? The only thing they care about is winning a match. And this marks the debut for... Xavier Woods in the cruiserweight division. So is he able to pick up the win here? is great to see mm. tremendous sportsmanship Look. mutual Wait, respect what? for each other you can feel the I think that was supposed to be Brian Kendrick this is going to be some battle one on one right. mano a mano Xavier Woods shaking the hand of his tag partner Kofi oh, Kingston there's some good contact by Xavier Woods hits the headbutt whoa look out and just a hellacious chop the Brian Kendrick with some nice offense here. As Xavier Woods getting the reversal. Man, Xavier Woods, what offense. Check out Xavier Woods offense. He misses the dive. And unfortunately for him, there was no water in the pool. And I think what that was, was uh, Kofi Kingston wishing... Oh. Yeah, I, I was going to say they were, Take like, up. went you to the back. Good old -fashioned butt so, yeah, He's I don't even know what that was. If an opponent exhibits a weakness for a specific move, some will return nice to utilize that move as long as possible. So now Xavier Woods He's getting going, for it all. going to the top. He's starting to show nice truck and run over there. He knew this is going to be a fight yep. heading into this one. Yeah, but it looks to me like he still has plenty of energy in that body of his. I wouldn't look too much into this right now. Yeah, but if you count them out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Mark my words. Not giving Xavier Woods a chance to recover. Smart. And it's Xavier Woods executing nice reversal the reversal there. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Impressive show of strength here, guys. Yeah, but think about all the energy this is likely sapping. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. Reversal by Xavier Woods. A nice car can run Making his statement as we speak. Now Xavier Woods looking for his finisher. Kick to the knee and he comes up big there. I can't believe it, Michael. Oh man, I believe that Kendrick was lost in the woods. 
And now Xavier Woods with a pinfall, but no. Brian Kendrick kicking out at two. Man, Xavier Woods, what offense. Whoa, missed by a large margin there. Come on, how do you miss by that much? Plenty of can't miss TV on Thursday, but nothing more can't miss than this broadcast of WWE television. He is a one-man gang in there. Now Brian Kendrick with the slice spread. Spread number two. Number two, that wow. is. This might be it. And kick out at two. He knows he's in trouble. Into the captain's hook. And captain took. Here's a chance to win. Xavier Woods with the rope, went right? From bad to worse for Xavier Woods. This has just been pandemonium. Ain't no stopping him now. And now Xavier wins with a reversal. Both of these superstars looking a little worse for wear right now. Still trying to get back to his feet here. He's clearly in a bad way right now. The overhand punch connects. At what point do those thoughts creep in of what do I have to do to put this match to rest? I don't know. I don't know as a WWE superstar if you ever have those thoughts of self-doubt. Now Brian Kendrick with a pen. Xavier Woods barely for a little breather here, making maybe. the three oh, count there. Down. I like it. Good game plan. Whoa, did you see what he just Frankensteiner did? there. Showing very few signs of life here. Yeah, there's no way he comes back from this. Might as well ring the bell now. He has a huge elbow drop. This guy's a machine. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt kicking right here. There's got to be some point in the match where those thoughts start to creep in that it could be over. And then you got to dig down deep. And Xavier Get Woods busted open. Job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Moves like that can upset your opponent more than hurt them. these superstars have found that little extra something to keep themselves going now Xavier wins with the reversal oh boy he is rolling he's still not moving guys he might be out Cole I don't know about you guys, but it looks to me like these superstars are on their last legs here. Ain't no stopping them now. Come on, ref, get in there. Doesn't show any signs of getting up here, guys. No, he's taking one heck of a beating, Michael. This is definitely becoming a great match. Reversal. Xavier Woods with a nice reversal. Nice. And Zaguri, I believe that is. We're going to take another look at this. I can watch this move over and over. Oh, 
One, two, three. And Xavier Woods getting a win. It's all over. Here is your winner, Xavier Woods. Big win here to start the show. And if that matches any indication of what to expect here tonight, we are in for an amazing evening. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. Well, nice win for Xavier Woods. As next up, we have mid-card action as Brock Lesnar going up against Rusev. CM Punk, what is Bobby Lashley doing? <laughs> Here he comes, the conqueror, the man who stopped the Undertaker's WrestleMania undefeated streak, Brock Lesnar. That's right, Michael, he did what many believe could not be done, myself included. And of course, Rick, thank you to everybody. Well, Team MMA back, back together. And what I mean by that is, I was able to find the create created wrestlers on community creations of these two, which honestly it wasn't that hard to find them. Who just appeared in the ring. And now, America, I ask you to stand up and put your hand on your heart and welcome the one and only true American hero. He is my husband, which means he is the only man that can have me. Welcome the Bulgarian brute, Rusev! Oh, here comes the ball. Well, that's interesting. Group. Rusev. And don't expect anything fancy from Rusev in this one. This man's all about reckless abandon inside the ring. Byron, I gotta say, you seem like you're ready to jump out of your seat in anticipation for this one. Yeah, it's either excitement or there's actually a good chance I ate too much Halloween candy. I can't tell. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is immediately going to be with some offense. One on one, mano a mano. And it looks to me like this entire arena is on its feet, and understandably so. And the energy level here in New Orleans is not all that different from the one we felt back at WrestleMania 30. Brock Lesnar with a reversal. Well executed clothesline. A huge clothesline there. And so, what are your thoughts right now on Brock Lesnar? What, in your opinion, can the WWE Universe expect from him here? 
Strap into those seats back home, people, because the WWE rocket ship has launched and will soon hit the stratosphere. Oh, boy, I can't wait to see if he finishes what he started. That's what the great ones do. The mighty Brock Lesnar and Whipton. Surprised Vicious by this strikes there. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. He's certainly in now a tough Rusev spot here, guys, but still plenty of time. Plus, it's not like his opponent is running away with this thing. Well, at least not yet, anyway. When Brock Lesnar appears on WWE programming, Brock you can guarantee for a moment. somebody's going to get hurt. Seriously hurt. I don't know if there's anybody who can stop this man. At least I think he floated in that. Definitely looked like it. Reversal by Brock Lesnar. Superstar signs a contract to face Brock Lesnar. You've accepted the fact that you're going on a ride to Suplex City, and that it's going to be a bumpy one. A suplex followed by a pin, but kick out one. Clearly not enough damage done. Lana having words with Brock Lesnar. He slams him down with authority. Rusev's playing it up big time now. Look at this. And what a reversal from Rusev. Neck breaker. Lesnar with a nice reversal. Solana slipping a steel chair and to the ring when for we talk Rusev. Lesnar, we're talking about an animal. An animal who's dominated every level of competition he's ever entered. An animal who will tear an opponent to shreds until there's nothing left. The great ones always explode when they have the chance. What can Rusev do here to up the odds for success? Guys, this is where we find out what he's made of. He's definitely got all pistons firing right and now. Rusev knocking out the referee. The WWE official. I don't think he meant out. to, but... Bell's run, but... Run, but... Well, now the map shins. Rusev definitely intended for that steel chair shot to be used on Brock Lesnar, but... Unfortunately, missing and hitting the referee instead, while the referee was distracted. Well, up next, it's our main event as John Cena going up against Big E.
here comes Big E to the ring. You can bet the fun and games will be over. We've seen it countless times before, Michael. The man is all business inside that ring. I'd like to thank everybody for spending a portion of their Halloween with us here tonight. Next year, guys, I'm thinking the three of us should come in a theme costume. Perhaps the fabulous Freebirds or, dare I say, the Wyatt family. I will never dress up for you. Last week, John Cena going up against Bret Hart, winning that match. So is John Cena able to beat Big E here tonight? Well, we'll find out next. Both men enter this match with tidal waves of momentum, which set them on a collision course for this very moment. It's all or nothing, and these two men wouldn't have it any other way. When I looked at the card for tonight, this one definitely stood out as one you don't want to miss. John Cena with a reversal. Well, what's your take right now on John Cena? So what can these WWE fans expect out of him tonight? This can go either way, Cole. Right now, it appears to be more of a feeling out process. Well, only way to rise to the top of the WWE Universe is to win consistently. And that's what he's looking to do here. Does press. Now John Cena. Nobody evoked more emotion from the WWE Universe on than Big John e, Cena. But for more than 15 years, Big I e was just nice to offense here to see WWE standard bearer. Now a reversal. Big E starting to slow down a bit here. I fully expect him to bounce back though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. John Cena setting up for a stench press. Match. It just goes along with the territory, and he knows that. I doubt he's all that concerned at this point. The good news for him is that he doesn't appear to have taken too much offense up to this point, but that can obviously all change here. Having called many matches throughout John Cena's career, I can say he's the most polarizing figure in WWE history. Whether you love the leader of the C Nation or not, everyone respects this man. We all know the WWE Universe is not shy about voicing their opinions. When it comes to John Cena, everyone has their opinion. But everyone also knows that when the lights are shining at their brightest, Cena John Cena is best. with a reversal. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Nope, reverses it. John Cena with a nice reversal. John Cena got him there. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. Look at that big E. John Cena busting big E open. He's calling for it. Now, John Cena looking for the attitude adjustment. Now in for the pin. Only a two count Big E kicking out. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. Whoops, not even close. What was he thinking? Now John Cena with an, another pin. Wait, are we sure that that kick out at two. He isn't going to go away that easy. I was never a fan of showboating, but there's a time and a place for it. Just ask Cena. When this guy's on, look out. Big E, belly to belly. Belly to belly suplex. Now. Like his chances here. 
Big E going for the pin. And he goes for the pin. This one's not over yet. Immediate and kick out. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things big E setting up for the big for ending. Right Big ending, the big ending connects. An immediate kick out at one. Camel clutch locked in. Battling to get the upper hand. John Cena wow, getting out of that. I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. Wisely bringing the action back into the ring. His shoulders are down and a kick out by Kick Cena. out That's one. Right, Cole. On the shoulders here. And it could be a long way down from there. He's taking a lot of punishment. If it continues, it could eventually affect his vision. And just a sickening thud upon impact. Now John Cena trying to get a comeback. Ain't no stopping him now. DDT and by John Cena. Him. Somebody's on a mission tonight. With the elbow drop. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. And now, John Cena setting up for the five knuckle shuffle. Nick connects. Come on, Big e. Now, in for a pin. And John Cena with the win. Nice win for John Cena. And that's it for Tuesday Night Smackdown. Now we'll see you this Thursday for Impact Wrestling.